Hey boo, knock knock hello. You did not think that I would be back after I dropped the ball on Vlogmas Day 1. But guess what boo? Welcome back to Vlogmas Day 4, shoddy. Dashing, dashing, ooh, that, let's that, get it. That, oh, let's that, that, dashing through the snow in my 1993. Welcome to my first Vlogmas in the year of 2020. Hopefully I'll make you laugh, and if not, that's really my bad. But either way, somehow you fan my channel and it makes me glad. Oh, that's actually all I have for the lyrics. Awkward. Hey Shadi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tiana, and whoever you are, wherever you are, I hope you're having a good day. I hope you're in a good mood, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Okay. So for today's video, I'm going to be giving you stocking stuffer ideas it may seem a little like dry and like like who cares about stocking stuffers but hello hey boo how are you I care about stocking stuffers because let me tell you every year my stocking seems to be a little on and passing you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying so these ideas can be used on anybody I guess the age range if you really felt like you needed one could be from like teenage years to like one up to like 90 I guess like I don't really think it matters but with all that being said let's get into the video so I'm looking at this list and pretty much everything on it should be under $20 and I think 90% of the list should be under $5 so let me get comfortable first up on my list I have chapstick chapstick or those EOS um, chapstick balls. I think those are so cute. I used to have one, um, it was like the mint scented kind. I had it like years ago. Everyone can clearly use chapstick in their life. You can pretty much find chapstick. You guys know where to find chapstick. Like don't, don't play with me and act like you don't know where to find chapstick. Wally World, Tarjay, anywhere. The second one that I have is Christmas socks. Christmas socks or like regular socks. Let's say like you have a big family. If you buy like a 10 pack of socks, you could just take one and like just roll them up and put them like in each person's stocking. But obviously, if you have like a five person family, they can each get like two pairs of socks. I think that's pretty cute. The third one on the list are those mini hand lotions. I think those are so cute. You know how like you just be in public and you just look down and you just be ashy out of nowhere? Especially if you black, you get ashy in this crevice, in this very specific crevice all the time. And you just like... Hey boo, what's your problem? And if you have a guy in your life, you can try to look for um, like the plain unscented lotions. I'm sure they would appreciate that because I'm sure guys don't want to be ashy either. Like being ashy is just like a crime against God. Like I, okay. For the fourth one that I have, you can try makeup remover wipes. I got a pack last year in my stocking stuffer and I really, really loved them. I was telling my best friend about it and I was just like, Oh, these makeup remover wipes, they work so good. I've been using baby wipes, and baby wipes, I would have to use so many. And my best friend was like, that's because they're not makeup remover wipes. And I was just like, you right. <laughs> so, <laughs> for the fifth one that I have, you can buy individual face masks. They're usually about like a dollar, I think. And they're usually like on one of the end caps in like Walmart. That's where I get mine from. And for the sixth one, you can do candy or gum. I get candy and gum in my stocking stuffer like every year. Pretty, a lot of these I usually get. Like not just like boring peppermints. Like like don't be cheap. Put in some like Hershey's Kisses. And what else do I usually get? For the gum, we usually get like, you know, like you just buy like a pack of gum. Put like one individual pack in each person's stocking. Like that's just. And then boom, because like everyone's always asking for gum. Like people be like gum fiends. Like you got some gum? Who got some gum? You got some gum? <laughs> and candy, obviously you can use like whichever kind of candy that you want to use. Just don't be dry. Nobody want nobody's peppermints. Like that's what the gum is for. The seventh one that I have, you can use nail polish. Last year, I think I got a mood color, like a mood changing nail polish. It was actually pretty cool. For number eight, I have headphones. You can do like the little earbud headphones. There are dollar headphones out there. I do not suggest getting nobody no dollar headphones. Dig deep, boo. Where are you going? Where are you going with dollar he with dollar headphones? Where are you going? Hmm? There are $5 headphones out there. There are $10 headphones out there. If you got Shami, there are like $100 headphones out there. But I think... 
You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know nobody who's getting no hundred dollar headphones and nobody's stocking stuffer, okay? Number nine, you can do gift cards. Now, this one is kind of like a cop out, but if you like, I don't know, if you like wanted to get somebody something extra and you just like ran out of time or like you just genuinely did not know what else to get them, get them a gift card to like their favorite place. I feel like everyone does Starbucks. And I really wish people would stop doing that. Stop trying me. Everybody does not want to walk in a Starbucks and spend ten dollars on something to drink, huh? No, I'm not that thirsty, okay? I'm sure that Starbucks is popping, and I'm sure that their drinks are worth it. But stop giving people Starbucks gift cards. Everybody does not want a tall or a mini caramel miata Starbucks drink with extra sprinkles, no sprinkles. Add the whipped cream. Hold half the whipped cream, extra two pumps, minus three pumps type of drink. Everybody's not that thirsty. No, boo. No, no. Mm -mm. Who wants to willingly spend $10 on a Starbucks drink on purpose? No, everybody doesn't want to do that. Stop doing that. Mm. And I don't mean give them a Dunkin' Donuts gift card either. <laughs> Figure out something that they really love, whether it's Xbox, PlayStation, Google Play, Apple Store, Goodwill, their favorite thrift store, Walmart, Target, Chick-fil-A, like figure out their favorite like fast food, something that they're obsessed with and use that money to something good. Stop giving people Okay. Okay. Mhm. Mm Cuz you seem like you going to give them a Starbucks gift card anyway. Okay. No, it's cool. It's cool. I'm just going to mark it off the list, but don't say I didn't tell you so. Do not say that I didn't tell you so. Number 10, I have bath bombs. You can get bath bombs pretty much from anywhere. And the only thing is, if you do choose to give somebody a bath bomb, make sure it's not a cheap bath bomb. But I heard that if you get someone like one of those really cheap bath bombs, that it can actually stain their tub. So, I almost said toilet. We're not going to talk about it though. Number 11, you can do body wash. And body wash you can pretty much get from anywhere. One full size of body wash. Or you can get one of the cute little mini body washes that they sell at like walmart victoria's secret bath and body works get you a mini bath wash that would be so cute number 12 is also a cop out but i think it's like one of the most obvious things you can do money give somebody some money you can put it in one of those tiny little gift boxes and just put it in there and boom that's just like extra money for someone to have again like the gift cards if you if you feel like you didn't get somebody enough because i'm sure everybody will be very appreciative especially this year of any type of gift that they'll get but if you feel like you didn't get someone enough or you wanted to get somebody something more get you one of those dollar tree little gift boxes and put you some money in there number 13 i have pop sockets i think you can get pop sockets from like blue 21 forever 21 you can like order them from wish you can order them from amazon but don't be buying a 20 dollar pop socket don't buy you a don't buy a 20 dollar pop socket you know what it's your money do what you want but don't buy a twenty dollar pop socket. Who needs a twenty? Who needs? Who honestly needs a twenty dollar pop socket? You said who? No, they don't. They don't. I promise you, they don't. Hold on, I need some chapstick. Chapstick. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. And just a little bit of lip gloss. One say, yeah, saying. Number fourteen, a phone case. A phone case can easily fit into a stocking. So, again, you can order those from Wish. You can order those from AliExpress. It may take 20 years to arrive, but that's just the risk that you might have to take. If you order it now, it will come by next year. It will get here by next year for next year's stocking stuffer. So go ahead and get you some. Number 15, you can do keychains. Again, easy. Five Below have a lot of really cute keychains. They have a lot of really cute keychains. For number 16, I have film for Polaroid. I feel like if you know someone who has that, if they already have one, of course they're going to need more film depending on how many times they use it. So if they use it a lot, then go ahead and get them some more film. I think that would be a really cute stocking stuffer. This next one is for my men. Here you go. Number 17, you can do razors for men, I think, and for women because I hear that women actually be using like men razors. So number 18, I have mascara. And mascara, I feel like it's something that girls are constantly running out of especially after you've used it 100 times and it just has the nerve to disrespect you and just dry up and it's just like boo i only use you about 100 times what are you crying for why are you so dry for come back to life for please i know that this has happened to you at least one time you go and buy mascara and you get home and it's brown and you're like 
what? <laughs> Who wears brown mascara on purpose? Nobody. Uh -uh. <laughs> For number 19, I suggest a travel nail kit, like cute little nail clippers and tweezers. And that's also another good one. Tweezers could be a stocking stuffer. But like cute little, um, cute little like nail clippers. Why am I up here saying nail clippers, huh? Like a cute little nail file or those cute little nail scissors. Like those come like in a pack and you can actually get those from Dollar Tree. The next thing that I have for number 20 is actually a travel size sewing kit. Now I got one of these last year by my best friend's boyfriend. And it is the cutest thing that I've ever seen in my entire life. Let me, let me show you. I mean, she's not as cute as she was when I first got her because she's a little disorganized. But look at this. But it came with like all your basic colors of thread, measuring tape, a thing of safety pins, little pair of scissors, and threading needles. When I got this in my stocking stuffer, I said, <laughs> I'm about to be sewing. I don't know what I'm sewing, but I'm about to get a hole in something. I'm about to sew it up, okay? You said what? You said you got a hole in what? Girl, you hype. You always need my help with something. Come here. What color? What color are you even? What color are you even wearing? What color is that? If my blanket is disturbing you, I'm sorry, but I'm trying to be professional because if I turn on my mini heater, you're not gonna be able to hear me, okay? Number 21, I have a back scratcher. Now again, extremely random, but again, who would not want a back scratcher? And you best believe that I have one. It looks small and tiny. Ba ba bam! Ooh, ooh, get off me, get off me, get off me. For number 22, you can do cologne or perfume again in the mini travel size. I think that's so cute, like when you're like on the go and you just need like a cute little like spritz spritz. Now, number 23, it could be used for anyone, but I think this one for me personally, I put it on the list because it was more directed towards men. Number 23 is a wallet. Now, I know a few men that do not carry wallets, they just carry their money around in their pockets it could never be me 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 there are men out there who do not have wallets and it's just like where are you going i just number 24 is a lanyard i used to call lanyards keychains because i didn't know it was called a lanyard the lanyard is just like the thick daddy part of the keychain you can get a really cute lanyard from like hot topic five below walmart might have some cute ones but they might be a little generic aliexpress and wish you might have to order it this year just to get it by next year to be in somebody's stocking that's stuffed Number 25, I have a beauty blender. I've seen like big packs of those that you can like buy and then you can like divvy them up. Like some of these, like I said, you can buy them in like in bulk and like divvy them up between different people. For number 26, I have a nose trimmer. Now a nose trimmer in my opinion, it could be considered an actual gift or it could be considered a stocky stuffer. For number 27, I have beef jerky. Some of you might be like, girl, what you talking about? But apparently, People love beef jerky. This is news to me. Like, I just found this out this year. Like, I have come across a few people that actually desire beef jerky. And they have all these different flavors. And then some of them come with cheese. And I'm just like, you know what? We might have to talk about this. Mm -hmm. Beef jerky is a little on the pricier side, though. For a snack, that one was for, like, the man, like, stocking stuffer. But I do know some females that actually like beef jerky. It's a little slutzy. You might want to put a little a little drink in that stocking stuffer because it might leave you a little thirsty. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> for number 28, I have a charger. Obviously, you just want to make sure you get the right charger. I personally love, like, the 10 feet chargers from 5 and below. But the only thing is, I just wish they didn't die so fast. It is so annoying. And while we're at it, another good stocking stuffer would be an ox cord. Everyone wants to be past the ox, but you can't pass nobody the ox if you don't have an ox. Number 29 is extremely random and I 1000% understand. For number 29, you can use reusable or metal straws. And I think you can even get metal straws at like Walmart or Target. Don't think that they sell them individually. I've only seen them on like the end caps in packs, like you know what I mean? I found a really nice pack of reusable straws at Ross and I think they were like $6. And for number 30, the very last one that I have 
is a compact mirror. I did look on AliExpress for a little bit. Some of them, they were cute, but I don't know. I don't know. But that is all. I know my energy was a little, it was down a few notches. That may appease some of you, but I'm gonna get back to being hyped someday. So don't, don't think I ain't on a path, you know what I'm saying? If you like my vibe, if you like my energy, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I would really, really appreciate it. And on your way to subscribing to the channel, please do not forget to like and leave me a comment. So that is all that I have for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching as usual. And I hope you have a great day, night, whenever it is that you guys are watching this. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye! As you can tell my channel's on and poppin', on and, poppin'. and I wanna thank you so much Thanks, for stopping boo. by But if you don't wanna get in the eye Come on, acapella then subscribe, then subscribe, then subscribe Everybody! As you can tell my channel's on and poppin' Okay, I hear you and you wanna thank you so much for stopping yeah, yeah. by But if you don't wanna you get better in sing, the eye Then subscribe, then subscribe, ah. then subscribe I'm serious about that Starbucks gift card.